Hello, this is Marjorie Wildcraft, and on this version of Homesteading Basics, we're going to talk about what you can do in your garden if you've got 30 days before the crop you really want to plant is going to be ready. Well, uh, this is one of the containers. I don't know if you've been watching the series that I've been doing on container planting. This is one of my favorite containers. And what I love to grow in this every year is a good crop of garlic. Now garlic, uh, here I'm in Central Texas, we typically plant this in October, November. Garlic generally is an overwinter type crop. And uh, right now it's, it's early September. So I've got about a month really before um, I need to plant the garlic in here. So, and I, but I've got it all planted up and ready and I'm like, what can I do? I got a month. So I'll tell you what the best crop to grow is if you've only got 30 days and that's radishes. Um, and gosh, radishes are so great. They grow anywhere, they grow so fast. They don't need a huge amount of fertility. And in my next version of Homesteading Basics, I'll show you how you can cook them and prepare them in a way that it takes away the heat and actually makes them a really wonderful food. This is Marjorie Wildcraft. I'll see you on the next Homesteading Basics.